I mean, my, I have a couple of uh, thoughts that I think run pretty, pretty uh, consistently with what we now know to be um, the trends of actual people who do MOOCs and who complete them and who do well in them. And that is, they tend to be people who are already pretty advantaged in the area of higher education. Um, I know I've seen some work that's, that shows that the people who get the most out of MOOCs already have advanced degrees, so they're good learners. Mm -hmm. uh, they're self-sufficient learners, and they have a lot of probably um, learning resources at their disposal to fill gaps. I know that was completely the case with me um, taking the social network analysis class. I could just look up the research she was citing if I didn't, if I wanted to know more and read the actual stuff, which I did quite a lot. Um, and if I needed help, I had people I could turn to who knew statistics or who knew this or that or knew how to install the software. Um, so I was a, a intensely aware, even going through this, I'm like, oh, this is not for a beginner. You know, don't try this at home because... <laughs> um, I have I have a research university in my backyard which is helping me learn from this but